everyone i hope everyone is well and i'm just coming through to do a little vlog um i just been feeling like blah lately i just been feeling blah and so i was like i need to it's time to level up i got to level up i gotta do better i gotta like we take care of everybody else but we don't take care of ourselves and i that's just something i just really had to come to the realization of so i was like i'm going to just try to start pampering myself more often so um went to the mall yesterday got my eyebrows done i know you can't tell right now because i don't have them like filled in all the way but she uh, i like to get mine threaded so i was like i'm gonna get my eyebrows done i bought me another nose piercing you can't tell it's a star I don't know if you could tell or not, but it's a star. And um, my fiance had actually got me another ring. I had lost mine. Actually, I think one of the boys had accidentally knocked it over and it got lost. So I was very, very grateful for him to get me another one. And I'm actually on the way to get lash extensions, like professional lash extensions for the first time. So I'm gonna give me some lashes. And then, like, my hair had been looking crazy because y'all know I'm transitioning to text lax. And my hair is so thick that I feel like I'm transitioning to natural because, like, the, the, the detangling has been, like, I washed my hair last night. It usually only takes me, like, maybe 15 minute tops to blow dry my hair. It, I was in the bathroom, like, 30, 40 minutes trying to blow dry my hair just to avoid breakage i was trying to blow dry like super super carefully i had to keep stopping i had to blow dry in extremely small sections to keep from having a lot of breakage i had to keep applying leave-in products so this this definitely is um different than what i'm used to and so um i've been doing that and then i'm going to do my nails my nails deep doing done and I'm going to do my toenails and I'm gonna shave and just just do a lot of maintenance on myself to get myself feeling as best possible. So I'm gonna update you guys along the way and everything. But those are a few of the things I've already done and I'm on the way now to get my lashes done. My fiance getting them done for me. So thank you. I know you're watching this. So thank you so much for spoiling me all the time. Thank you, thank you, I love you. But anyways, it's a beautiful day out here. Hang on one second. <laughs> it's a beautiful day out here. And I'll probably start the video back once I get in the car from um, getting my lashes done. Okay, I've made it here and it's the place right there. It says Decalash. So I'm gonna go in there and we'll see all right so i just came out i've been in there for an hour and this is how my lashes look i got the natural ones so these are how they look i really like them i'm kind of thinking about going a little i don't want to say extra extreme but a little fuller next time but i, I might i might just keep it like this because these look really i like how they look natural they don't look like lashes like you know some people are like boom these look like feminine nice and nice and feminine i like it something like to treat myself and i like how they she kind of put the little i got the they they got four different like styles and i got the cat eye style so like the lash kind of like goes up on the ends like that so, let me know what y'all think. But I'm about to get headed home. Um, I was trying to think about that's over there. <laughs> and I'm trying to think about do I want to go over there and get me some Starbucks or just go on home and chill out until the boys get out of school. But I'm on a mission to level up. So, so far, I got my brows done, my lashes done, another nasal ring my hair i washed my hair and curled it got another ring and then like i said i want to do my nails my toenails i need to shave and um give me give me a cute outfit or something like that 
yeah get a cute outfit and the weather is just very beautiful out here it's sunshiny and um this is definitely the time of the year to start getting extra cute and jazzy you know so i think i'm also gonna start inc incorporating um I know I've been saying this forever, but like daily walks, like I need to start getting, I need to start walking, getting more active and less sugar, less sugar. So I can look how I want to look this summer and it, not even just for the summer, but for every month of the year, just feel good, look good, um, enjoy life. Like life is so short and temporary. We like, we like think that. I don't know. I just feel like we take a lot of things for granted. So I just want to just enjoy each and every day of my life, my son's life, my fiance, my my other family members. Um, I just want to not take anything for granted and just be very grateful and thankful for everything I do have. And I just want to enjoy life and treat myself as well. Like, cause I hardly, I hardly ever treat myself for real. So. Yay! My fiance was like, go get your lashes done, go get your lashes done. Cause I kept doubting myself. He was like, why don't you treat yourself? Cause I mean, he he paid for it. And he was like, you're not even paying for it. You still doubting uh, going. And I was like, uh, I don't know why I'm like that. Like, you know, I'll do stuff for my kids before I do something for myself, but I do need to start doing stuff for myself so he he was like you know here's my car go and get your lashes done so I'm thankful so they give you a little list of things that you shouldn't do and the lady who did my lashes her name is Miss Hope in case you're ever in the Chattanooga area and of course I went ahead and bought the little you don't have to buy this but it's like a little kit um, it has the lash cleaner and the little, some kind of special Q-tips that are not cotton. And then makeup remover pads and what is this? Oh, is that a mirror? Hold on. Oh, uh, a little mirror. And a little, look like a little makeup brush in there. So I, I had went ahead and got this little kit as well and i got the membership it, it just makes sense to get the membership because like the membership i can come every two weeks um and get a refill but if you don't get the membership then it'll be 75 dollars every time you come and get a refill and it's it's suggested that you come every two to three weeks so um yeah so I've been ripping and running all day, got the boys from school, did a little more ripping and running, and I done made it home. And let me tell you what happened earlier. So, okay, I'm at the red light by the freeway, like when you when you coming off and you have to get at the red light. And I seen a man had a sign. His sign said, homeless and hungry. That's exactly what it said. And for some reason, I was just moved to like... I had ordered some Taco Bell and I had a Chalupa that I hadn't even touched still in my bag. So I was like, I was like, I'm gonna get his Chalupa to him, you know. And I had um, a cup of water that I had not drunk out of, brand new. Roll my window down. Tell me why. I was like, um, do you want this Chalupa? Do y'all know? That, do y'all know this man said no? He said no. So basically, you just want the money where you can go and do what we all pretty much know what you're going to do with it. Like, because if you was really hungry, on your side, it say homeless and hungry. If you was really hungry, you would have took the food. And I'm actually glad he didn't take it because he could have took it and just threw it away or whatever. But, you know, I'm glad he didn't take it so that, I mean, I went ahead and ate it, but I was going to. The fact that I was going to give it to him because I thought he was hungry. But you just want to get a few dollars up where you can go and blow it. And then go back to the corner and, and beg for some more change. And it's like, I know everybody that's like standing on the corner not panhandling. Some people really do need help. But like people like that, 
You got hungry on your sign, but you're not even accepting food. Make it make sense. Like, that don't, that don't make no type of sense. None. So, I just had to, what y'all think about that? I just had to tell somebody. I'm like, oh my God, I cannot believe that. That's why I rarely, like, let my one down and get him anything. Because you just never know who is real and who is not, like, you know, as far as, you know, panhandling. But anyways, made it home. I'll probably be finishing up this this vlog. It might take a few days to finish. Because I'm on my little level up journey. Oh, and I also meant to tell y'all that um, we're actually going out of town. We're going to Florida. Yay! We're going to Florida. So if y'all want me to vlog that, let me know down below in the comments. And my fiance might agree to being on camera because I asked him. He he keep asking me. He like, you gonna vlog that? You gonna vlog that? And I'm like, why? You want me to vlog it? Like, are you, you, you okay being seen? So he, I think he might like, if I vlog this, this trip, we're gonna be gone for a few days. So, um, cause I'm gonna take plenty of pictures and videos, but am I gonna post it is the question. Cause I always take you know, for my personal collection or whatever. So we'll see. But yep, yeah, let me know what y'all think about that down below. So I'm gonna be using these press-ons right here for my nails. I love short nails because I really can't do what I like to do with long nails. So I, I actually prefer short or petite nails. These are really pretty. I'm gonna put these on. I'm gonna be coloring my painting my toes with this right here. This is the color golden. Sally Hansen Extreme. I thought this was a really pretty color. This is what I like to use to remove unwanted hair. I'm gonna use this right here. And this Afro Puff ponytail, I wore this about two weeks ago, but I got another one right here. I'm gonna wear this one. This was a little bit bigger and a little bit looser. And then this one is a little more defined, a little tighter. So, I'm going to put my hair in another afro puff. So here are what my nails are looking like after I applied them. Very cute, petite, and feminine. And I did paint my toenails. Here's what my hair and outfit looks like. I think everything turned out great. The level up looks awesome. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment box. If you have any questions or comments, just let me know. Thanks for watching.